I'm Brandon Lang, and this is your Saturday edition of My Two Cents. We'll get to your complimentary winner in just a moment. We're going to take a little peek at South Carolina rolling into Auburn. We'll look at Duke and North Carolina. We'll break them down for you in just a second. Speaking of breaking it down, for the second straight week, we're behind the eight ball, but we step up on Friday and get it done. As Wisconsin Green Bay takes care of Detroit Mercy minus the two, 93-81. So the 20-dimer on the Friday card sets the table for another Saturday, Sunday, Monday, 3-0 sweep. We do that. It'll be winning week number three in a row. We do that. It will be seven of eight winning weeks. Listen, 12-1-1 run in college basketball. Winning month of February. Monster winning month of February after the losing month of January. That monster month of February provides the winning year here so far in 2018. But I'm not going to shy away from the fact that I've been kind of stuck in the mud the last week and a half, two weeks. Just not getting a roll going. You know what? I got a roll going last weekend in college basketball. I feel good about the roll I'm about to go on this weekend. First things first. 40 dime double downer. Underdog shocker today. Looking for two straight winning days. Looking for this 40-dime winner. More importantly, looking to get a winning Saturday. That is the key. I want winning week number three in a row. I want seven of eight winning weeks to go through the kind of run I've gone through and be in position to do that. Money management and discipline equals to success. I'll let two straight winning weeks and six of my last seven stand on its own. Merits. 40 diamond on this Saturday card, twice as strong as Wisconsin Green Bay yesterday. Let's get another big time winning day. All right. Complimentary winner in a moment. My two cents. Well, the combine I've always found to be really interesting. The combine to me is a, a great thing to watch if you're a football fan. And Lamar Jackson of Louisville came out and said, listen, I'm a quarterback. I intend to go to the NFL and play quarterback. Lamar, if you maintain that stance, I have three words for you. Canadian Football League. See, Lamar, I was at your bowl game in Jacksonville against Mississippi State. I saw you throw four interceptions. Four of the worst interceptions I have seen from a college quarterback since Blaine Gabbard in his bowl game not rocket scientist, Lamar, not rocket science. If you can't read defenses in the NFL, you are not playing quarterback in the NFL, and your problem is, Lamar, you can't read defenses. Okay? So let's make sure we're clear on that. So you might want to think about wide receiver. If you maintain you want to be a quarterback in the NFL, I assure you, you will not be a quarterback in the NFL. All right. Complimentary winner. Little two team five point teaser. Let's start you off with South Carolina and Auburn. Now, South Carolina was balling. They rolled into Florida, won the game outright as a 10 and a half point underdog. Then they proceeded to lose six straight games, the last of which was a cover at Tennessee. They lost 70 67 in overtime, got the cover plus 10 and a half. They then turn around the very next game and at home against Auburn, dominated the Tigers. That, of course, is ignited. Five straight covers for Frankie Martin's boys, and now the rematch against Auburn, and I don't think Auburn blows this team out. No way. The interior presence of South Carolina here will be too much. Let's take South Carolina from plus the juicy 11 number up to plus 16. Duke and North Carolina, simply put, Duke won the first game, second meeting right here. Let's just make sure that North Carolina is 9-3 and three against the spread. Their last 12 trips into Duke. And conversely, the road team has gone a validated and a documented 18-7 and seven against the spread the last 25. Let's take North Carolina from plus 7 up to plus 12. North Carolina plus 12, South Carolina plus 16. Your two-team five-point college basketball teaser for Saturday. That's it, everybody. 40-dime double-downer today in college basketball. Win or lose on Brandon Lang. We'll see you back here on Sunday with another edition of My Two Cents.